Hello, today on the bench I have this multimeter which is the 2DM200A by, made by Greenlee. Actually, this is not an electronic multi, uh, multimeter because you, you find it uh, mainly on industrial uh, purpose. And the problem with this is uh, you can have a message error on the display which is in air, in air, inner, in and by for internal and error for error and this internal error comes from the fact that you will have a very sophisticated plug uh, on this uh, multimeter because actually this kind of multimeter is able to give you a beep when you make a mistake according if you are looking for a voltage and you are your probe your probe on the amp, amp outlet so this uh, those outlet here are a sophisticated uh, connection here which is made by two contacts side by side and one side is to permit the connection between between them and uh, co uh, to confirm that you are in the good outlet to the main board if you have a uh, disrupt on the connection between this uh, this part here and the the connection here you will found a message error and your uh, multimeter is inusable. So if you found this kind of uh, error on your multimeter, you need to reflow actually your, you need to reflow exactly your, uh, this, those connection here, like this. And you need here first you can you just need to reflow this one and of course you need to reflow this one and this one of course to be sure you need to reflow all of the connection here because the process is exactly the same so here I put a little solder because I had to remove the solder to uh, to remove uh, the main board here. Okay. So now uh, you have here the connection between uh, the multimeter and the battery made like that because we cannot uh, uh, sometimes use the back of the multimeter to make the connection. And look what normally is work fine now. You will not have the uh, internal error message. It comes from the bad connection here. Of course, for better coaches, you need uh, actually to put um, here some product like that on the connection by. Uh, you here by uh, desoldering dis dis those those connection which are the connection with the big fuse and um, you can uh, of course you need to reflow those uh, those uh, those pin here and also you uh, you have to clean your connection if you have the in air inner inner like this as you can see inner okay if you have this kind of error on your workbench, on your multimeter, if you have this kind of error, in, uh, okay, look here. Of course, what I made here is I uh, is to clean, of course, to clean, to clean with alcohol the connection because if there is any residue on it. Okay, now you need to to dry this connection because if you have any dust or any any residue on it, you will have this error of connection. If I put my finger here, look, this is the internal error coming from those kind of connection. Look, so you have to keep your you have to keep your internals here very clean so actually with a, a q-tip like this you have to clean correctly inside look there is okay you need to clean inside your connection 
to make um, to, to make uh, disappear this error. So now the multimeter is fully working. It was Alexander again. I hope you like this video. Until you see you soon.